hello everyone and welcome back i'm going to be cutting and sewing tobacco i'm using black material stretch material stretch on this side and stretch on this side for the head circumference i will be needing 22 inches because the material is stretched The measurement I have here is 12 inches after folding it to two. I fold the material into two. After folding it to two, I have 12 inches here. Length 16 inches. I will hem I will hem this place with one and a half inch here. One and a half inch. After hemming with one and a half inch, it will remain 14 and a half inches. So from here, from here to here is 16 inches. After finish cutting, I will leave one and a half inch from here to here is one and a half inch then I will sew to here and I will sew up to here when I'm done sewing remember I'm going to be needing 22 inches 22 inches so I will sew the re I will use the remaining inch to sew here to here and I will sew to here then I will leave this one and a half inch before I hem here with one and a half inch. After I finish sewing, before I hem here, I'm done sewing. I'm done with the sewing, and I sew handmade sticker on the back. On the back part. Place on your machine like this, raise this side up and sew plinth on the back. If you want, you can do that or use thread and needle to make gather on the back. I have thread and needle ready, so I start like this. Up to top here remember I sew from here then to down I leave one and a half inch here so I will sew up to this place this very place here like this this is the back this is the front this is the up like this and I will tie this place then I will sew back And I will tie on this side. And I will sew back again. Like three to four, five times. I will sew back. When I sew this way, I will tie. I will sew back this way. I will tie. I will sew this way. Tie. They want to make design on top they want to make braid on top i measure five and a half inches then from here five and a half inches i will cut i have three pieces i 
I have three pieces. So what I will do now is to fold like this and so fold like this so and fold like this and so after finish sewing i will bring the right side out i have five and a half inches by 13 inches bring the three together like this and I will sew here I just sew this place to hold the three together then I will start with the braid so after holding with strong cell with cell tape I will start with the braid I will remove the cello tape and go and sew here. I will sew this place. I'm done sewing. I will bring the back this way. Like this. This is the back. This is the one and a half inch. So I will place this inside from here. From here, I will pass the braided one inside and bring it out from here. Like this. Then I will use this. This one I will bring it like this what I will do is to gently place it on my machine like this and sew here bring it together like this bring it together like this and sew I'm done with the sewing you can use thread and needle to sew here if it's too thick for your machine you can use thread and needle to sew here i'm going to tack the braided one on top the tuba so it doesn't move around i mark the center this is the back So I mark the center. I use thread and needle to tack this place so it doesn't move. I will tack here. I will tack just here two or three times. Then I will tie on the back. This is the finished look guys as always if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you are new you are welcome please subscribe and remember the notification bell please share this video to friends and loved ones thank you so so much for watching and i will see you all in my next video bye